Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Megan. If you're new and you like what you see, I'd appreciate it if you gave me a little tap on that subscribe button. I am happy to report that my son did get the spot in preschool. So today's video is going to be all about Caleb and his back to school clothing haul. I don't know if he's going to need one, but it was on sale. And this is from the Disney store. Oh, it's so cute. He loves superheroes my mom actually got this for him we went shopping together I grabbed these t-shirts isn't that so cute the genie and a little um mickey and pals shirt these are great quality for the price i love getting stuff from the disney store it lasts a long time i got him stuff last year their sizes run a little bit different in my opinion. Um, so the ones that I got him last year still fit him. So I don't know if I bought them too big or not, but they still haven't shrunk or anything. He also got this. I believe my mom bought him this one. The next store we went to is Oshkosh. And from Molly, they literally had nothing in her size. All little girls must be a size medium right now going into first grade. I don't know. But Caleb hit the jackpot. We got him pretty much, I think, everything except his sneakers at Oshkosh. These ones are going to be from my mom. We went to the outlets, by the way. We have um, a few outlets. Well, not Nara, so it was a pretty decent drive. We drove all the way to rent the Mass to get these. I think I'm going to be sitting too close. But these are actually pajamas. They glow in the dark. It says, look out world. And then this cute sweatshirt. It's actually already getting pretty cool here. I think yesterday was like 62 to 65. And today I went outside and it's really cold out. Um, but in New England, and I'm sure there's other places in the world that are like that, tomorrow could be 90 until we hit like real fall fall stuff. and i have to say i took molly and went looking for her and my husband who normally could care less what i get the kids he took caleb because it was packed in there he took caleb and he pretty much picked everything i think i picked two or three things so this is a pack of underwear and i picked them out because one of them has a sloth on it <laughs> I don't think he's gonna care about that. He's gonna like the dinosaur on the skateboard, but I enjoyed a little sloth. So that's that. This is a seven pack and they were 50% off. So this is $28, so 50% off that. I'm not, I'm not a mathematician, so I can't tell you exactly what it costs. I had, I had gone on my personal Facebook page because I have a lot of teacher friends and moms who have already been through this with their boys. And this is my first time with a boy sending him to school. Like, I don't know. So I just assumed it would be easier to send him with like just sweatpants and Velcro shoes. And I mean, he is only three. So, and he's just, he's... He's pretty new to potty training. I mean, it's been a couple months now, I'd say. A month and a half, maybe. He doesn't really have accidents. He does really, really well. Um, but I don't want it to be hard for him in a new surrounding to have to, like, figure out how to take his pants off and, like, get to the bathroom. And I know the teachers will help. But, and a lot of um, you said yes. No clips, no buttons, nothing. So we did a lot of... Um, elastic waist and sweatpants so we got these i don't know what these are called anymore but when i was a kid they were called swishy pants or like basketball pants so we got him that and we did get him a, uh, a few different sizes so this is a 3t we did between 3t and 4t because he's kind of in between and i wanted stuff to last so once winter hit we wouldn't have to buy too much more um, stuff for him. So like this one I got a 4T. They're stretch jeans. But then inside is um, it's like thicker. It's, it's not fleece or anything. 
it's just a thicker jean so it will be a little bit warmer um, because it gets really cold here well we really went with the blues I guess uh, sweatpants in the navy blue and then pretty much everything uh, you see he's gonna have a matching pants and a mat he basically got him sweatsuits socks I picked those the socks and the underwear this is so cute it's got like a little spaceman and some planets on it and then this is the matching hoodie for it he loves baby shock so I mean this isn't baby shock but it's shocks on it because he's very into that I think they were in sunglasses yeah they were in sunglasses again that's the sweater and we got the matching pants. I'm sitting way too close. Matching pants. We got him this nice jacket. Again, navy blue and gray. And it's not, I wouldn't consider it a winter jacket. It's between like a windbreaker and a sweater type of thing. So it'll be good for like the really cold fall days that you need a little bit more than like a rain jacket or a sweater and like the beginning winter days where it's not like, you know, miserable out. So it's basically a windbreaker and then there's like this material inside and then when you flip it, it's uh, like a fleece sweater and it's detachable so he can wear um, just the sweater let me show you better so that's the inside so that would be the outside if you wanted to wear just the inside piece and then there's like zippers to detach it and then this is the jacket depending on how we wore it as a windbreaker or the full jacket the sweatsuit so just some gray sweatpants and then we got a new pop of color a little red in here and again everything's from Oshkosh they had some great deals at the outlet a lot of things are 50% off we got him a lot of the same shirts just in different colors I like this one Anything that we missed on getting him, which I usually get from Molly, is I try, if they have them out, I try to get the holiday stuff, like a Halloween shirt, a Thanksgiving shirt, a Christmas shirt. Um, they didn't have any out for boys, so we didn't end up getting that. This one's short sleeved. It's so cute. And again, a lot of these go with, they coordinate with the sweatsuits my husband picked out. And he picked out all these shirts. I didn't pick anything out. And this one, he was so proud of this one because it glows in the dark and it goes with the shock sweatsuit, sweatsuit, sweatsuit. <laughs> and because it, it says chomp chomp on it, like, you know, baby shock. And this shirt was marked down to $4.99. Went to Target, my favorite store in the whole wide world. And, well, Target and Disney. But if you are a big Disney fan like me and you followed along with the D23 exclusives this weekend, Disney Store is going into Target. So hopefully I don't go broke. <laughs> so we got him another pack of underwear. Again, these are from Target. And they are, I don't know, there's a glare. They are Toy Story 4. And we got him two packs of underwear, one from Oshkosh and one from Target, because we still don't know what his preschool is going to require. We're going to find out in a couple of days, but I just wanted to be a little ahead. And, um, oh, there's Forky. I'm assuming we're going to have to send in, like, just in case underwear and outfits and stuff. So I wanted to be sure he was nice and stocked up. And I don't know why, like, I do this. Maybe everybody does this, but like for back to school, I always get my kids new, well, Molly, but now Caleb. I just feel like I have to get her a new underwear, new socks, new, like all that type of stuff. She doesn't really need it, but I just feel like I have to get it. 
for the new year. I don't know. <laughs> and then last, we got him some sneakers. They came in this cute Toy Story box. They are Toy Story. They have Buzz and Woody. And they're his favorite colors, orange and green. With the Velcro. I think these were, they say $24.99, but I'm pretty sure they were on sale. Um, for like $19.99. And again, I asked about sneakers to my friends and my cousin who is a preschool teacher said um, she recommended not getting anything with lights because it can be distracting and Caleb would definitely be distracted <laughs> because he saw all the ones with lights on the, the shelves at the store and he was like, not even paying attention to these after. So no lights on the shoes. Where Molly, we do let her get lights on her shoes. Also from Target, there's some more uh, sweatsuits. Surprise, surprise. And these, again, my mom bought. She went a little extra. She's excited he's going to school, too. So she got him this. And it goes with the water bottle she got him that I showed you earlier. It's a nice little sweatshirt. Not too heavy, not too light. And it has matching sweatpants she got him a PJ mask because he also loves them shirt another pair of jeans with the no clips no buttons perfect for him to go pee pee another Marvel shirt I'm pretty sure these are all from Target, she told me. The sweatsuit, actually, I think she got on Amazon. You can find some really great stuff on Amazon. You just really have to, in my personal experience. Sorry, I have really bad allergies right now, and I don't know what it is. So if I look a little who, I'm just letting my face breathe, so... In my experience on Amazon you really have to read the descriptions and the reviews people give because sometimes you can get some stuff and it's a little won't. like I don't do that third-party stuff because it never works out for me <laughs> she got him this I believe is from Target yeah it's Cottis and it's a two-piece like a nice little dressy outfit. Be a little different for him. Yeah, so that's it. That's everything we got. I think in all we spent about $200. Um, might sound like a lot. I would sometimes think that. But you have to realize this is Caleb's first time going to school. We want to be prepared. And also he's grown so much since the last um fall season or winter season even spring that none of those clothes fit him anymore i've already had to donate them so as of right now he only has summer clothes and our summer is quickly fading so he needed these he was going to need these regardless of if he was going to school or not so i'm very proud we got a lot of stuff like a lot of stuff especially because my mom got him a few things so I hope you liked Caleb's little clothing haul. If you liked seeing a boy clothing haul and you want to see more things for a three and a half year old boy or boy in general, give me a like. Let me know in the comments if you've gotten any of these same things for your child or grandson or nephew or friend. Um, I like seeing what other, other people got so that's why I like to show what I got. And right now is a really good time to go. The Labor Day sales for some places have already started. And Labor Day is literally next week. Molly starts school in two more days. So today is Monday. She starts on Wednesday. Let me stop rambling. I hope you like this video. Again, if you like the content on my channel, I would appreciate if you would subscribe. And give me your feedback in the comments below. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.